Hey, hello there, Aries. Welcome. I'm so grateful you're here to watch your tarot card reading. This card reading covers August 26th to September 1st of 2018. This is a general reading. More extensive readings can be booked by sending me a question through email or click the link below. Your every comment earns you an entry to win a free reading. Hit that notification bell so you know for when you win. Another winner picked tomorrow. Remember, check out your past video predictions. They will resonate more clearly when the week has arrived. Okay, Aries, I have blessed, shuffled, and meditated over this card reading just for you. Your first card, it's the general atmosphere of that week. It's the basis of the matter. It's the background of your question. Number four of the major arcana in the Rider Waite deck, the Emperor. Number four, the Emperor, stands for authority and leadership. It can also stand for paternity. It's stability and ambition and domination. It's controlled and directed attention. You may feel under this person's influence so you need to stand up for yourself and rely on your own power. You might be organizing or prioritizing, maybe dealing with your father, having to defend boundaries, solving problems, being protective. It's control and has to do with laws and rules. And the planet that governs this card is Jupiter. Your second card, it's the energy crossing over your path, the immediate future. It's occurring now. Number nine, the Hermit, another major card of the Rider Waite deck. Number nine, the Hermit. This card stands for solitude and self-study. It's examination. It's also researching and investigating. A guide figure may come into your life. This is a time for patience and things are going to work out quietly. This is a search for truth and it will be rewarding. It's the light at the end of the tunnel but you feel like withdrawing. This guide figure is going to offer you help. You're moving towards a goal this is a time of healing. This guide figure is going to offer you wisdom. There's going to be a big devotion that goes long run. You still feel like isolating yourself and reflecting on your goals. You're seeking something. This is the card of Virgo. Your third card, and this is how it affects you. The King of Swords. The King of Swords is bringing in air energy, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. This is more than likely a person. They seem like a stern figure. They're so involved with their mental work. This is a good counselor. They speak with eloquence. They have sound advice. He knows the truth. He is fair and he always speaks the truth. You need to listen for the correct approach. He has a connection. It could be the strong, silent type that once you get to know him, he talks your ear off. He also believes in keeping his word. This stands for mental leadership. Could be a very charming leader. Your fourth card, it's the future, the outcome, the results, and the advice how to respond. Number 11 of the Major Arcana in the Rider Waite deck, Justice. Number 11, another card of truth and justice. This is balance, also stands for Libra and karma and justice will be done. In legal matters, balance is required and lawsuits will be won. 
You're striving for truth and balance, and you're trusting divine order. Just a reminder to just be just. And your hard work really does matter. So you should deliberate calmly and carefully before you take any action. You need to be cautious and prudent and careful. Rely on your inner self because divine justice cuts through illusions and picks out the facts. This is the ability to tell right from wrong and another reminder to always keep your promises. Fifth card, it's the bottom of the deck card. It's the underlying issue. It's what's unseen. The Eight of Wands. The Eight of Wands, Aries. This is fast movement fast communication. It's action and air travel, and things are going to unfold rapidly. It's a busy, exciting, hopeful period. Positive things are going to be unfoldedly, unfolding and very rapidly. It is the end of delay. There's messages, maybe even letters of love. Could have been swept off your feet, but this is an approach to a goal. You're going to be reaching a conclusion, a very quick resolution. Could be surprises, new opportunities, something you're going to need to act quickly about. You will be multitasking, and there's really going to be some quick results here. Thank you so much, Aries. I love all your comments and validations and subscribes. Bless you. Now remember, what goes around comes around, so keep it positive. Love and light.